is Morgan. I'm here with Phil Tote sailing on the 367 Karma. What number, Mac, is this for you on that boat? Uh, number six. Well, number six. Yeah. And you usually do pretty well, don't you? Yeah, I think we've, uh, number times we've done it, uh, I've done it six times. We've won it four times, and we've never been outside the top four. So. Now, what's the trick to that? We won't uh, post this until everybody uh, leaves, so nobody will see. Uh, well, we sail really hard. Uh, we don't sleep, sleep on the rail. And uh, yeah, just uh, we, we, we keep fresh drivers and, and good trimming and uh, just keep on the basics. And if your boat is this competitive, there's got to be a few key differences into how the boat is run, how what you're doing to prepare for the race. Oh, I see. Um, well, yeah, what we do differently, I think, than most boats is uh, the preparation before the race. Uh, Jack, Lou, and Marty, the owners, uh, they put a lot of time and effort in, you know, a couple weeks before to get the boat prepped. We have a big long checklist. We come in and, and make sure it's all done, that all the items are all ticked off. Uh, so when we do go racing, there's, there's nothing extra on the boat that we don't need, and there's, uh, you know, there's nothing that we're missing either. So the preparation that goes into it is huge, and it really gives us a big advantage uh, on the race course. Now, you're not from around here. No. Now, why do you get pulled in? What makes you so special? Uh, well, I've sailed with the guys, like I said, the last six years. Uh, Seth Morrell, one of the local guys here. I got, I got was very fortunate to sail with him in, on the West Coast. Uh, he's originally from the West Coast, and uh, he pulled me in to uh, help him out and help the team out, and um, as a as a helmsman as well. So, uh, just, just and I ended up making a lot of friends with the, with the guys, and and it's one one race that I really enjoy doing. Uh, because it's just the camaraderie and the friendship, and uh, I think that's the main reason I get pulled in, because they're my buddies. And now, what's your day job? Do you have one? It sounds like you're campaigning uh, yeah. a little bit. Uh, I, so, half my day job is Olympic campaigning, um, the, the fin for the U.S. sailing team, and, uh, and then I also do uh, I move my, uh, pro sailing. Sounds so, awful. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, after the Mac, where are you off to next? Uh, as soon as I leave Mac Island and I go straight to O'Hare Airport and I stri fly straight to uh, Europe, uh, doing the uh, doing the Dragon Worlds and then uh, and then uh, training in the Finn. So I'll be in uh, Valencia, uh, Lake Garda, and in Spain.